everyone, my name is Ellie Rookstar. You obviously know me um, from the Rookstar's channel. Uh, if you do enjoy this video, please subscribe and leave likes to these videos because it would really help me and my brother out. This video is a bit of a new one, I don't really do these much, but this is a tutorial video on the PC. So it's a bit laggy, it's because of my internet, it's not very good at the minute. But you'll still be able to understand it. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to put a webcam in the top of your video with VideoPad by NCH Software. Um, hopefully you do enjoy it and you learn something from it. Uh, I'm not going to be showing all the options, only how to do this. So first of all, you're going to want to open some of the files that you've already uh, made. So I am actually going to probably get... Hmm, what should I get? This one. This is just me showing my Instagram. Um, it's going to be a bit laggy. But Sorry guys, it's a bit of a weird time to be Yep, that's just that. <laughs> yep, that's just that. And you're going to want to open another video uh, to put underneath that. And I'm going to just get this bit of Xbox play I've got. And yeah, you can obviously watch it. Hi everyone, welcome to it. And that is got recording my voice in it too. So, um, first of all, you're going to want to click on the video that you want to be in one of the corners or whatever you want to minimise of it. Then you want to go and right click and go all the way down to video effects. Um, here is a video effects and you can do stuff as out of effect mask, um, clear effect mask, um, you can save effects and edit effects. But at now, right now we're going to want to add an effect. First of all, I like to start off with cropping my video. To crop your video, you can just pull these corners or these down so you could do that. But I don't really want to do that. I just want to uh, crop the corners. Just like this. My face is a bit weird in this one, but you know, cheeky little smile. Um, then you're going to want to go on this again and press on scale. Uh, this is going to minimise it. Um, to put in one of your corners if that's what you're going to do with it and uh, it does look a little bit stretched at the moment but don't worry this will get sorted it's a bit small ok that'll do then you're going to want to press on it again and go on position the position is a little bit laggy um, I think it is on everyone's to be honest and you're going to want to put it in one of the corners personally mine's the top right I always use that and yeah, that's how you do that. Then you're going to want to click the X and you can watch it. And it's in the corner, but there's nothing in the background. This is what I'm going to be explaining now. Then you're going to want to drag this into video track number one. You can watch it. Hi everyone, welcome. And obviously, because I've got a voice to webcam, I am going to turn off this, um, the audio, and you want to press on this little um, button down here that says change sound volume, and you're going to want to press on new and tick that. Um, after you have done that, get the video that you cropped earlier, and put it just above video track number one, and it will create another video track. And now you can see that I'm in the top corner of the video. And you want to get your videos in sync as much as possible when you're actually creating it. Otherwise, it would not make too much sense. But here we go. Sorry guys, it's, it's really and you have your webcam in the top of your video. Mine is a little bit laggy because my internet is not very good, as I explained at the start of the video. But anyway, you can do lots and lots more things. If you want me to teach you how to do some more... Um, just put in the comment section uh, what you want me to do and I will happily figure it out for myself and I will help you too. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a big fat thumbs up and I'll see you all next time. Bye!